Hey guys, this is Sohinky from Mahalo Games, and this is an educational video on Fight Night Champion for the Xbox 360. For more videos in this series, please visit mahalo.com slash fnchampionwt, and if you have any requests, please tweet us at video games. As always, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Very accurate with it. Oh, it's jammed in a round. You've got to win these early rounds for me. You're not shooting your chance. We showed you the video evidence earlier where we saw the replay of Andre Bishop injuring that right hand. The word we're getting ringside is that that injury dates back a bit, and it may be the cause of all his problems. They say he injured that right hand while he was in jail. Jam! Jam! Good job with another left hand. Johnson's not coming up with the results that you would want to see out of him. Now, he's trying to counterpunch Teddy, but it doesn't seem to be the answer. No, he kind of looks a little bit like that guy who went in to get his head dyed, you know? And he thought, he thought it was going to be just a little bit lighter, and it wound up being a lot lighter. And he said, wow, what the heck did I do? I, I didn't think I was going to look like this. I didn't think that I was going to box Here's like this. Cap. Keep moving. Keep moving. Hit the box. Scored well with that right hand, did Meldrick Johnson. Halfway into round number five here. He's committed to that left hand and it's working out. Good flush shot by Andre Bishop. Look at the accuracy with that hook upstairs. Bishop's doing what every trainer wants to see their fighter do. Land punches and bunches. The combination lands. Meldrick Johnson's on the bad end of a very impressive hook up top. And there's the left hand working well for him again. Bishop's combination punching, working out well there. He landed three solid shots. Every time Andre Bishop throws that right hand, he winces. He is in serious pain. And round five comes to an end. As this fight continues, it's becoming obvious that Bishop is actually comfortable winning this fight just with that left hand. This is impressive stuff. Good body shot, the right hand came home. An accurate left by Johnson. How is he able to do this? How is he able to take these shots? You know, one time Muhammad Ali talked about taking a chin. He had one of the great chins of all time. And what he basically talked about was that when you start to get hit those shots, you start to go down a hallway. And then you go into a gray room. You go from a light room to a gray room. And it That's a big flush punch landing on Andre Bishop. This is not the first time that Andre Bishop has been brought to this neighborhood. He has been shaken before. He will know what to do. A knifing left hand by Andre Bishop. A target on his head, and he places the hook right on it. Oh, and he stays downstairs. Pace yourself. And now another left. Good flush shot upstairs. Oh, a nice two-punch combo by Andre Bishop. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work, by he returned fire right there, and it worked. After being rocked, now he gets his man. At this point, it's not about the skills and the abilities of these two fighters. It's about the dreams of them, and one of them is being eliminated. Turn that up in there. He comes back with the left hand again. Stay away from that 
Just a dominating evening by Andre Bishop tonight. He is clearly up big on the scorecards. Trainer Gus Carissi has to know it. You can just see by the way he's dealing with him in between rounds. He knows it, and he can go two ways with it. Get the rounds out, work on things, carry him a little bit, or go close to show. The left hand coming into play by Johnson. Johnson showing a great ability to adjust. He was stunned earlier, but you can see he has changed things up stylistically. Hey, look, Joe, I was watching a football game in my room this afternoon, and you know what? The team was running the ball. All of a sudden, the run was taken away, so they started passing. I give him credit. You know, he's making an adjustment. He's trying to win the ball game. Well, well he's trying to win this fight. Back to basics here, as you can see the jab becoming a key instrument for him. Boxing 101. You have an opponent walking in. You want to stay on the outside? Use that jab. That's why they call it the sweet science. Good work nice. by Johnson. Nice. Yeah, real smart there. Making a miss, making him pay. A crushing two-punch combo by Andre Bishop. Nice job there, hooking to the body. Hooks to the head. There's another left hand from him. See how he targets that hook? This is what Andre Bishop talked to us about. He said, if I could target any one punch, it's going to be that big hook. Well, hit the target that time. Good job with another left hand. And makes that nice right angle on that hook upstairs. Great hook to the head that time. Johnson's once again the target of a hook. Johnson's showing a little bit of a defensive shell, but Teddy, I'm seeing punches still getting through and splitting that guard. Yeah, well, that's the problem, Joe, when you put those earmuffs on, but you don't move your head. Some of them are going to get through, and just as importantly, you handcuff yourself, so your opponent is going to stay in there a little bit longer, knowing that nothing's coming back right away. Carissi's game plan being executed perfectly by Andre Bishop in that last round. He has a lot of momentum. Yeah, now when he gets back to the corner, of course, Gus only has to tell him, keep doing what you're doing. But a guy like Gus, he'll remind him, hey, it starts with the jab. Always fundamentals. Brett, stay with me. You got to do more to win this fight. You got it. Final round of this fight for Andre Bishop in what has been a walk in the park with his supreme skill. And I'm sure the captain of the Titanic thought the same thing. And then, guess what? An iceberg. If there's no left hooks coming, he should be all right. And now a well-placed hook to the head. He's committed to that left hand, and it's working out. How about that exchange? That's nice work by Bishop there, landing the left hand. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by Andre Bishop. Now he's putting his punches together. The combination upstairs. Little head hunting with the left. Bishop's got that one gift that we have seen win time and time again, and that is pure speed. He's got it every which way. Yeah, he's putting those punches together. There's one way that you have to combat speed, and that's not trying to match it, and that's controlling distance and using timing. That's what his opponent needs to do now. Super two-punch combo by Andre Bishop. A hammering hook by Andre Bishop. Well, supposed to be fighting, but instead he's hugging. Johnson's getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Right to the head with that right. Cover up! Cover up! And there's the left hand working well for him again. That is a sharp uppercut by Meldrick Johnson. What impact with that uppercut by Andre Bishop completely one-sided fight at least that's the way we saw it yeah i mean if you saw it any other way you'd have to put a warning out the next time these judges judge a fight kind of like on a pack of cigarettes you know this could be hazardous to your health 
I mean, these guys could be hazardous to your career if they scored any other way. Here's the official decision. 